Hey guys, happy Saturday. I just wanted to make this quick little video to remind you, look, it's Saturday. It's, it's probably the time where most people would think I'm gonna relax. As a business owner and entrepreneur, this is the day where you're likely to get interrupted the least. Take advantage of days like today. I can tell you it's, it's the most peaceful when I choose Saturday as my day that I make progress on my business. So investing in yourself and your business is so wildly important, yet it's one of those things that we just neglect as an entrepreneur. We think our number one duty and, and the thing that we should be over delivering on is, is for our client's business, but it's true that at the end of the day, you don't have a business unless you can continue to build into yourself. And it's hard to remember that and very easy to tuck your head when you start your business and go, look, I'm just gonna crush it for my clients. It's a great goal and a great way of thinking and a good ambition. But if you do that for too long, you start to get in habits and rhythms and patterns and you're so burnt out that Saturday you just wanna rest. Use that rest as a way to build back into your business. It is refreshing. I know that's counterintuitive to think that working more is gonna be a little bit more, you know, it's gonna, it's not actually gonna to add to your stress um, or that it actually is gonna to add to your stress. That's not true. It's, it's the feeling of getting things done in your business is much better than the feeling of finishing a nap. I promise you. And I, I can practicing what I'm preaching, you know, I'm trying to, as you can see, I'm trying to build out my click funnels, watching a little Russell get things done and do it for myself. So this is something I've been neglecting is, is building my own uh, survey that feeds and filters and qualifies clients and leads. It's something I haven't been and been doing and spending much time doing. But um, that's what I'm gonna do this morning and that's that's what I'm gonna finish up. So I challenge you to take a look at what's going on in your business and your life. And is there any way that you can build back into your business, even though even though it's not something you typically would do, you're tired, you're stressed, try it out. See how you feel when you're done, because I promise you that that nap, that extra sleeping in, while it is 100% necessary, it is, we should be sleeping as entrepreneurs, we forget that. But that feeling of, the, that feeling alive, you know, the, the fact that you even started a business, that all that rushes back when you when you crush something and knock something out for your business, that, that drives to your yearly goals and objectives. So I challenge you to try that. Um, but if not, just relax too. You know, you know your limits, you know your boundaries, listen to them. There's nothing cool about working 80 hours, 100 hours, that's why we're entrepreneurs, to have choices. If your choice is to work all day, the weekends, into your business, that's your choice. But if you haven't done it, I just challenge you to try to devote one day of the weekend 100% for your business and see what happens. Don't take client calls, don't answer emails, don't, ha don't, as you can see in my browser, I don't even have my email open. I'm not gonna go into that rabbit hole of answering this client's emails for 45 minutes because it's 45 away from what I'm doing. So, I challenge you, think about it, try it out, let me know how it goes. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. We figure out why, and if it did work, figure out why and try to maximize that. So, I'll see you guys soon.